What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Dr. D-Dub. And Carson here. And welcome back to the forest. First off, we apologize if we sound tired or delirious at all. We're starting this recording at 1 a.m. Woo! Because work and scheduling, it's, it's not working for us. Anyway, so we were doing some log farming prior to today's episode, and we didn't even fill our storage. And it's not because we ran out of trees to... Well, it is kind of because we ran out of trees to cut down. Anyway, if you follow, if you follow with us over over this direction, so we've been cutting down all the trees in this area. We've shown this before, but for those of you that are new or just have never seen this area, we like to keep our tree stumps, and that's mainly Carson's desire. I've grown to like it as well, but where even did you go? There you go. So we got distracted. This whole area. <laughs> this whole area. All the way up to the, the snow line. And then even like past these trees right here. All the way to like that direction. So we don't really want to cut too many more trees because these trees right here are visible from the lakeside which is going to be part of our summer camp. So we need another way of getting logs. And we've come up with a system that we think will work is this really you being that? What are you, what are you doing? I'm trying to jump on you. I can see that. This is what we mean. This is the 1 a.m. recording in action. Hello. Anyway, we found a way that we think we're going to be able to bring logs in from elsewhere. And it's kind of far away, so we'll meet you there. All right, so this is where we're going to be collecting logs from. You can see the trees are incredibly dense here. And it's not too far away, and it's on a river. So base is back that direction. If you guys remember, early on we did a river exploration. If you travel down the river right there, base is that way. We travel down the river, it splits to the right, which is where we go towards the caves and where we've done the previous exploration off our rafts. And it splits to the left, and then again it splits to the left and to the right. And we're on that right path. So from our base you take a left, and then you take a right. And here we are. Oh so no, we're you moved. build this thing. Huh? <laughs> you moved. Oh, no, I, I moved. was on top of you. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to build this raft and we're going to load it full of log storage. Like full. And start transporting logs back. We've got a whole system in plan. Or in place. <laughs> in our minds. It's planned. In pla anyway, we're going to start building this thing. And we'll, we'll, we'll cut back to you when either we have interesting banter, or it's done. Rev your chainsaws, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do this. <laughs> I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. I work all night and I sleep all day. <laughs> what is that from? That's Monty Python, my friend. That's like vintage <laughs> Monty Python. It's too late to swamp. It doesn't cut from that height. You gotta cut it at the base. Ah, uh, that's a uh, that's one of them there rock trees. Yep. We're tired. <laughs> Whoa, that like slid out from the bottom. That's cool. What the heck? Wait, oh, what? Where did it? Oh, be. Gonna be falling. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> oh, oh geez, explosion. <laughs> it just rains trees, apparently. Alright though, we're done. It's beautiful. And done. Both both things. Okay, so when we grab this, we pilot it from the back. Right? So yeah. we need to make sure at least one of us can see. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so this takes two people to pilot. So from this side. Should probably leave this side open, so who's ever on the right? Because there's more... Yeah, not more. There's less room on this side. And we can fill this side with... Logs. Right. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Okay. We need to add some form of light on this, because... My goodness, it's dark. And we're going to be farming logs at all hours of the day. Ooh, can you put a ceiling? Whoa. Oh, you can't put a ceiling skull light on here. Placing up here is glitchy. Yeah? You can't place it on the platform. You can place it on the um, the fence, 
line. Place what? Uh, I have a just a standing scroll lamp, and it won't let me put it like on the ground, on the fence. Yes, the railing. Nowhere oh, else. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Yeah, you're not kidding. But I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> Be ridiculous. If it works, it works. I was gonna suggest one just like on the corner somewhere. The front too. Sure. Or just the one. As long as we, I mean, I don't think we need light on this thing. It's not gonna help us see. But yeah, I guess if we did it on the front, it would light up in front of us. That could be kind of cool. Anyway, we need to start getting a lot of these. Um, these. These? I feel bad for anyone whose first forest episode of ours this is to watch. Yes. <laughs> we tired. What? No, this is okay. this is great quality content, everyone. Don't you agree? Don't you want every episode from here on out to be filmed at one in the morning? Because I, I you know, if you do, just... I have words for Car you. <laughs> Carson. <laughs> what? No. What? Bad. <gasps> All right, so we know you can clip these through each other and do more storage and there's a part of me that kind of wants to do that like so Carson I know you can't see this right now um, usually we align basically the the far right log of one to the far left log of the other like so All right but you can also put them like halfway and I'm not gonna don't upgrade this one yet you can also do it like that but they actually glitch into each other which no, we're, we're not taking shortcuts, right? We're purists. We're purists? Okay. We're going to keep going with that then. Let's see how many of these we can get. I, I don't know how many we can fit on here, but we're going to find out. All right. It's been all night. The sun is rising, but we finally got everything built that we think we want. We wait, got our two skull wait, lamps wait, in the front. Wait, you're forgetting the most important finishing touch. No, this is all that's gonna we need a fit on the We need a gazebo <laughs> that's half on the boat, that's half on land. I think that's actually placed on the land and it's just clipping through the boat. Not to burst your bubble. Oh. Here. Here, I'll fix it. That's awkward. Oh. I think it's gonna do the same thing again, but... Oh. Anyway, while oh. Carson's messing around with his gazebo, we got two water collectors because we're probably gonna be over here for a while. So let's get things started. Oh my gosh, stop it. <laughs> and we've got, what Beautiful. did we say, 16 of these tall log storage, which hold 192 logs in total. We tried placing stuff up here, but as you saw earlier, it looks stupid. So we're not going to. But it's time to press E a whole bunch and get a lot of sticks. Gosh, this forest is so dense. It's a... It's beautiful. In insert random E meme here. E. I I'm just gonna... <laughs> we'll see you guys in a sec. Hey, we're done. Yes, on that note. That, are, are we done? Yeah. We're done. Yay. Uh, off that crazy oh, rambling. <laughs> What'd you say? Off that crazy rambling. Yeah, this is nice. All we need is a turtle show. And I kind of want to just go to the beach and get a turtle just so it's complete. And I'm, I'm totally going to kind of do that right now. Bye, Carson. Nope. Are you coming with? Actually, I'll start farming trees. I'll be responsible. You'll be responsible? Yep. Nah, there can only be one responsible person. Yeah. I shall go hunt turtles. Good. <laughs> Which is also responsible. Just not as necessary. Not as necessary. And I know there's turtles down here because it's a beach and beaches have turtles on. I think you're stereotyping the, the turtles. Yeah? Yeah. I Not all turtles are on beaches, dude. You're just like... you just. They're not all into that? Yeah, man. They have their... Some are classier. Yeah, man. They have classy turtles who don't like beaches. Are you saying that the beach isn't classy? Now, you, now you're just being offensive to the beach dwellers. What the heck, nah, dog? man. Gosh. I just can't win here, apparently. <laughs> no, you're just being so discriminatory. <laughs> well, I'm going to hunt for the, the beach-loving turtles. Oh, so the, the non-beach turtles aren't good enough for you? <laughs> No, there's hard to find, and I'm lazy because it's oh, okay. it's late. You know what? That's fair. Yeah. I, can't, I can't blame you on that one. 
There we go. Agree to be lazy because cause tired. You mean you haven't had your 10 shots of caffeine yet? Dude, I'm like, I'm like 10 espressos in at this point. Oh, that'd be funny if you weren't joking. <laughs> yup. <laughs> um, we, right. we got Turtles a new, uh, found, actually. we got a new Keurig machine at work today and they, they tasked me with getting it ready and that, that meant prepping and just running a lot of water through it. But instead of water, I just ran a bunch of cups of coffee through it because that's good for me. Right as I said, cool story by the way, right as I said, <laughs> there's no turtles. I look over to my left and there's turtles spawning out of the water. There's four of them right here. Yay! <laughs> Goodbye turtles. Thank you for your show. Oh, I feel so bad. I'm cutting up a turtle right in front of two other turtles. That's brutal. <laughs> and there's a third one. I'll kill a bird too so they know I'm not discriminating. Oh, thank you. Yes, yeah, good. Yeah. We, we kill everyone equally. I can't discriminate against the beach versus non-beach turtles, apparently. <laughs> yes. So I also can't discriminate in what I kill and yes. take their shell off their Now you're body. getting it. I'm proud of you, Doc. Uh -huh. Oh. proud of you. The devastation that we wreak. That we brought to this land. There's so much. Oh, man. Is this, is this, a, is this a work of art? Is this a statement about... How we as humans affect the environment and how we're destroying the uh, the beautiful earth that we live in on Yes, this game was definitely designed as a social commentary to humans. Yes Effect on nature. Yes 100% <laughs> mm, How do the cannibals fit into this metaphor? I'm, I must not be enlightened enough Are they uh are they global warming coming to bite us in the butt? Showing uh, quite literally, yeah, <laughs> to bite us and eat us but, um, in the butt. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh. You know, it's tired when sleep. I'm laughing at puns. All right, we're done. We didn't fill the whole thing, but most, we're also kind of tired and want to go to bed. And this is what one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety. Wow, I can't do basic math right now. One hundred and eight, I think. Yeah, that sounds right. Anyway, we got enough logs for what we're gonna do, and we also built our personal fires so we can stay warm if we have to pilot during the rain. But it's perfect timing because it's daytime. Do you want to grab that side and we'll try to try to pilot this thing? If I can pilot it. There it is. I had to find the button. Yeah, I'm having the same issue over here. If this is dangerous in that. Okay. So do we have any steering capability? Or is it literally just forward it, or back? It is just literally forward and back, but... Okay, I need you to go backwards then. Now, this forward. is gonna be tedious. Forward, and I think it goes uh -huh. slightly to the right naturally. I think it goes slightly to the left naturally. If you're holding it down. I'm holding it down. Yeah, it goes to the left. Oh, okay. I knew it was one of the directions. This is gonna be a a process, but this is way faster than taking a log cart over here or a log sled. Which, speaking of which, we, we, we got through farming all of these. We, we were sitting there, and we were getting further and further from the coast. And it's like, why didn't we build log sleds? Why didn't we build a log sled? All right, you're going to have to tell me when we need to turn left. Uh, well, we've got a lot of room to the left whenever we need to not be hitting the thing on the right. All right, so now we basically go until we get landlocked, which is, I don't know, it might be good to build. I think it's right here, actually. Or we can just clear that. Yep. Okay. I like it. This is going to work better then. And be less expensive for what we're about to build. I see stuff in front of us. Yeah, this is this is where we stop, basically. Okay, so let's stop here. Okay. So we have a plan for how this is going to work. So clearly this thing won't fit through this narrow gap that is in front of us. 
So this is where we're going to stop. Our plan is to build up a crane, like right here, basically. So next time, once we have the crane built, when we're coming in, we can just pretty much run into the crane. And then we're going to build a, a crane and a platform with a zip line on that platform and run it over, over yonder. And offload the logs via zip line, which is something I don't think we've shown on camera yet. Maybe? Maybe not? I don't know. I don't either. Okay, so we're gonna build a crane. And neither of us have built one of these before. But I do know do know a little bit about them. So when you're on the crane itself, you can see that middle portion right there. You can grab it and like pull yourself up but if it's all the way up and you need to lower it you have to grab it from ground level so if you look at the four corners only one side has a bundle of rope tied around it that's the side you'll need to grab are you trying to <laughs> i'm trying to play something right now yep sorry so disrespectful yep that's my mo so we'll need to place the rope side basically facing where we're at or where we're going to be coming from so we'll do it on the right there something like that and then we want this as tall as possible because we need as much of a height difference to get the zip line to go that direction all right that looks decent 11 logs oh that's oh that's perfect we got one with 11. beautiful I believe. I can make more. <laughs> Whoa, that sounded like it finished a lot of stuff all at the same time. Okay, so now if we get back on here and we pilot this thing into... Gosh. this Putting the fires where we did might not have been the best idea. Just because interacting with this thing is now very difficult. And I just set myself on fire. Very nice. Oh, you made it up already? <laughs> I like this. This is like a nice little tower, right? It's kind of fun. Now, what happens if I actually jump, used one, What happens but... if I jump down right now into like the water? Can we get it back down? Yes. How? So I was just explaining that. Oh, good. When it's when it's all the way up, there's only one corner that has a rope on it, so I can grab it and I can control it from here. Oh, okay. Ha having fun? Maybe a little. You were clipping through it so bad on my screen. Okay, anyway. So that's as low as it goes. And so this thing requires two people to pilot. But if... Carson, can I get your assistance in piloting, sir? I mean, I wouldn't call what I do piloting, but yes. Just We just need to go straight into it. Not back away from it. Straight into it. There we go. There we go. Okay. And so now that it's there, this thing should go up and down. We can even control it from right here. Oh, this is so nice. Oh, crap. I forgot one very important part. We need to actually build log holders on this thing, too. Oh, yeah? That's okay, though. That won't take long. But in addition to this, we also need to build a platform on which the zip line will rest. And this will go pretty much flush with it. Not quite, because we're never gonna actually need to get on it. All right, so this is the platform that took entirely too long to place properly, but it's there and it's gonna be perfect. And it requires 22 logs, which actually isn't that bad. I guess we should I don't know. The order that we do this in doesn't matter too much. We just need to get it built. Today's episode was... We were planning on doing some building or blueprint laying around the base and get it kind of ironed out and get a plan going. And then we realized we didn't have enough logs to do anything. Also extending our walls because, oh lord, have we messed up. We, we goofed big. Okay, this is going to work though. Now we just need to get a couple a couple log holders on here. Hopefully that still clears. It should, I would think. It doesn't hang off either edge. Right. And then we could do two more over here. And we said we had si Oh, and that works out perfectly, right? Because we have 16 on the boat. So it would be four trips. 
to get them all off if we fully uh, vote it? Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. Yay, 2 a.m. math. I think it's correct, though. So, at least it sounds correct to me. Do the logs hang down, or how, how are they sent down? Do we need, like, a certain amount of height to clear, or...? Are you asking about while they're on the zip line? Yeah. Yes. So they do... They're suspended from it. Okay. But... Oh, and we can walk... Oh, that's nice. This is gonna work so beautifully. I hope. These are 26 logs each, or sticks each, though, and we don't have any sticks really close by, so we might need to grab 26. If we fill our inventories and grab a log sled each of sticks, we can get these done real fast. Okay, gonna hop on. Oh, that's not the thing. Moment of truth, does it clear? It works. Okay. This is so awesome. And now to build the zip line. Okay. So, did you run a foundation already? Uh, I did, but or, it, not, not right now, but All right, we're going to get a foundation ran real quick just to test what height we can do this on. All right. I can only see about halfway down before it disappears into nothing. Also, this is probably incredibly expensive if we were to actually build uh, it. 272 logs. That's not happening. I was going to say, that's not terrible, and then I rethought that's it, like, and that is like terrible. A boat and a that's not happening. It's a boat and a half full. I'm trying to think. Okay, so I guess I'll uh, start running the zipline over. All right, so we ran, we ran our guide, a.k.a. Custom Foundation, over. And we were going back and forth on how we wanted to do this. We could put it down here. But I remember that you could do a, a platform on a like cliff face. And it created a, a little platform. And I'm pretty sure the way this works is the logs are suspended from the zip line. And as soon as they hit the end, it lets go and sends them flying forwards. So this should theoretically work. Unless I'm wrong, then it's going to work terribly. But we're going to stop after we do this one way or another. So, Carson, do you want to clear your platform that you were so dying yes. to, to get rid of? It's kind of cool looking. Like, it's just, it reminds me of, like, a roller coaster. Like, the wooden supports, it's just the same thing over and over and over again. Do you know it would be kind of interesting to make in this game? A, um, what? like, a sky bridge and just have, like, giant platforms like that just running across the map uh, above everything. You know how expensive that would yes. be? <laughs> yes, I do. Oh my gosh, that would be terrible. It'd be awesome to have, right? but to build? That's like something you'd have to log no into like thanks. a community server and be like, alright everyone, we've got respawning trees, we're going at this, let's go. Or just put mods right. on. Then again, you could just fly everywhere. I'm sure. And you wouldn't need to do yeah. that. Maybe you can, maybe there's like an infinite resources mode or something. There's a... Isn't there a creative mode in this? I'm pretty sure once you beat the game, you unlock a creative oh, mode. Really? Yeah, that'd be handy. Mm -hmm. It would. All right, so this is going to go right right hither. Something something like that. Get, and then... Oh, can you I'm get, build yeah, that? Yeah, I'm working on it. Okay, I totally did not communicate that at all. This is going to be nice. And it's going to make our log farming sessions into, like, actual log farming sessions. Beforehand, I used to be able to get on, or Carson could get on, and I would just leave the game running in the background while he would farm or something. Or we'd farm together, but now this kind of forces us to do it together, since that thing requires two people to pilot. Yay! We have to... Oh, this is a creepy sight coming up across this alligator that's skinned alive. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't need the meat if you but... want it. Oh, so close. I almost placed this, and this should work. It should. We're about to find out. Doing it up here is too high. You can see right here, it's pretty obvious that it goes the other direction. 
But from down here, it should work, we hope. Is that the last one? There it is. All right. Oh, gosh. Okay, so it looks like it will work. It's just being dumb. All right, are you ready for this, Carson? Yep. Oh, we're going to have to actually build it, right? I know, but... Okay, so it's 12 rope, 10 logs. That's... If you want to keep going on the, the logs, <gasps> I'll start on the rope. We've got uh, a secret stash back at base. Not so secret. We showed you guys where it's at. It's under our dock, but that's now so far away. <laughs> All right, let's get this thing built. Oh, let's go. So we can go to sleep. For the sleep. It's done. Hello. It's done. Now to find out if it actually works, because obviously we can't grab it on this side. That's a good thing. That means it's going the correct direction. In hindsight, this platform should probably be like here. So it's not running into a rock. But let me move these and we'll test how this works. This is either going to go really well or really terribly. Fingers crossed. Are you headed yes. over there? You want to do the honors of sending yeah, them down? Absolutely. You want to catch it? I will see. I will watch and see what happens. It's probably not going to work to be completely bah, humbug. realistic. Physics I mean, in this game. Who knows how they're going to work? I make. I, I don't care because either way we're going to bed Ooh, after this. Let's go. <laughs> Are we excited about that? It's almost 2.45 in the morning. All right. Here we go. All right. Let, let me know when you send it. We're sending it. It's going. It's going real good. I can actually see it all the way from you. It's coming real good. Okay, so it does... I, I am wrong. It drops right there. But, just keep sending them. I want to see what happens. So, I've never seen this done this way with someone on either end. This actually might work really nicely depending on how many it can hold before it starts doing weird stuff. So right now, Carson, you can't see this, but it's just filling up the zip line, like in between it. And now that it's full, they're gonna start dropping down below it, it looks like. <laughs> this is hilarious. Uh, I'm excited to see Hold this. on, don't, don't send more than, actually that whole thing is 48, yeah. right? Okay, so this isn't working exactly like we wanted. I was wrong in that they go flying. They literally stop dead in their tracks and then pile up and fall oh, down. No. So there's a giant pile on the ground below it. But nothing's... We could grab some from here. Oh, gosh. Okay, I think it works. Are you sure? Would you be able to bring that... I I'm sure. Would you be able to bring that log cart over by any chance? Um, yeah, I can. I'm gonna have to grab the log cart from back at base and fill it up with sticks. Bring that over here so we can make two more log carts. So that way we can carry all of those in four log carts. Jeez, how many more do you have to <laughs> send? Last two. <laughs> God, that's a lot. That's a process, though. So if we had filled that thing up completely, that right there was a fourth of a load. That's kind of really fun to watch. I'm ready to see this pile. Can I cut across with the log cart here? Is this... You should be yeah. able to. I just don't want to pull a Carson. I, yeah, I might have just pulled a Carson. Don't pull Carson. Carson. Remember the position or the log cart? Well, no, I, depends on where you no, are. No, be, because I, at. I like took a step off. Of, I was trying to round a cliff, but I guess like my my model clipped up and then down, and then the whole thing flipped, and now it's in water. This sounds like excuses to me. Uh, you're not wrong. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. What'd you do? <laughs> Nothing. Can you play around in the piles of logs and they go flying everywhere? Is that a thing? This is nuts. It's so many. 
This is so unnecessary. I love it. But fun. So yeah, this is our system of getting logs over. It's messy right now. We'll probably tweak it somehow. I don't know how. If you guys have any suggestions on how to improve this, let us know. Other than making that end taller, that would solve all of our problems, actually. Did I just grab that out of your hand? No. Maybe. I don't no. know. Okay. Maybe. I, I don't know anymore. What's going on? Are there more logs? Did we lose some? We might have lost some. Are there any in the rocks? Um. Because technically we, we had the four extra up top and I sent 48. So we hit that 50 limit. Did we when did we despawn a few? Well, no, the, you're right. So there should be. T we should only be missing two. Um. Well, we're missing more than two. And that looks like it's the case. No. We're, we're, no, this is nine, right? Yeah, that's nine. We're missing three. So we technically lost one. Obviously, we lost the one because we had fifty-two on yeah. the ground. So we lost those two, but there's one that's MIA, possibly in a rock, possibly gone forever. Or maybe it splashed into the water when the pile went boom. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, anyways. It's bedtime for us. That's our log system. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry we're a little out of it today. Hey man, prime quality content. Whatever it takes for our viewers, even at 3 a.m. Oh, I found it. It's over here. Wow, that got sent flying. <laughs> okay, so it did work. All 50 made it over. We lost two because we passed the 50 on the ground limit. That I, there I is. think your math is wrong here. We have four carts that hold 12 each. That's that's 48. And now we're, we're missing two, so we have 46. We're missing like six right now. We have four carts that hold 12 48. each. Three, three of the carts have 12. Three. One has 10. Yeah. So we're at 46. Six. We started at 52. And we sent 48 over. With four extra. There were four on the ground. You're right. Yeah. There should be 50. Yes. Over here. I'm sure they probably just went flying like that one did over there. Probably into the water. It's possible. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys like our log system. Again, if you have any suggestions as how to make this work, slight. What are you talking about? You didn't even grab all the ones up top. Oh, there's some on that. That makes sense. I grabbed the ones that were like behind it. I didn't see those. Huh. Well, that makes sense. That's five of the six. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So one is missing. One is missing. But yeah, if you guys have any suggestions, clearly that's not working quite how we thought or how we planned, but it, it's whatever. It serves its purpose. It gets them over here. We can make this work, even if we never improve upon it. But thank you guys very much for watching. We're tired. We're going to bed. We'll see you in the next one. And until then, as always, take care. <laughs>